Hello everyone and welcome back to a new tutorial on the how to make an accounting system series. So in the past couple of tutorials I've showed you guys how to make an accounting system that has quite a lot of features such as multipliers, unequip all and some stuff like that. But we still have a couple of problems such as when you equip a pet, go ahead and equip the other pet and we'll equip it but the other pet will still say equip. Now, I mean unequip. So we're going to fix this in this tutorial and maybe add some other stuff. But before we do that, I want to let you guys know that I have Patreon. So if you want to support me or want to have access to every single one of my tutorial files, you can get those on my $10 tier. With that being said, let's start. So what we're going to be doing is entering our inventory client script and scrolling down to where it says... Uh, equip button the mouse button one click on connect function so right between these two lines what we're going to be doing is make adding a for loop so for i comma v in pairs and scrolling frame can get children do if v con is a and a gy button then so if it is a gy button uh by the way gy button is either uh image button or text button so if it is one of those then what we're going to be doing is checking and its name uh i, I, I literally almost wrote its name and the con uh, dot name is equal equal to template then v dot on find for find first child equipped the value is equal to false now after doing that you want to copy that paste it here and what i'm going to do is test the game so play the game and see if that works so equip a pet equip another pet go back to the other pet and still the same thing we might have messed up something so we'll try to fix that so what i'm going to do is set the equipped value of, of every single template to false and after doing that Oh, I know, sorry about that, but in here, don't do uh, and v.name is equal equal to template, do and v.name is not equal to template then. So do the same thing here, and if you go ahead and play the game now, that should hopefully work. So I'm going to equip the sun cat, equip the fairy, and go back to the sun cat, and it says equip this time. But as you can see, we have to double click each time to equip a pet, which is pretty weird. But before we fix that, I'm going to fix this. When we play the game and equip a pet, we have these shadows that don't really look that good. And it will just make your game lag if too many people have too many pets. And we really don't want that. So... To fix this bug, it's not really a bug, it's a feature. I'm going to go to my egg underscore server script. And in here where it says, um, clone to clone clone, I'm going to do for i comma v in pairs clone to clone get descendants do if v clone is, is a and we can check if it's a base part or vcon is a union operation union operation then v dot um vcon find or v dot cast shadow dot value is equal to true i mean dot cast shadow is equal to false because i don't think you have to do a dot value 
so let's equip a fairy and as you can see it doesn't have those shadows anymore which is pretty good and i think this is going to be it for today's quick tutorial if this helped make sure to subscribe like the video share it with your friends and i will see you all in the next video bye